I think it's safe to say, and I think we all agree, that Angel Share by Killian has to be one of the best boozy gourmand fragrances that was ever released. And I know some of you don't like it, but guess what? That's just facts. But what's the problem with Angel Share? The problem to me is that a 50 ml like this roughly retails for around 230 to 300 dollars. We'll say 280. That's really expensive. I know not all of us, including me, have just like. $300 to go drop on a 50 ml fragrance. But things have changing. There's the, the clone game, the dupes are on their eyes. And there's a lot of good ones of Angel Share, I will say. But the best one that I found so far, that is absolutely the closest, in my opinion, has to be Royal Blend by French Avenue, which is a sub brand of Fragrance World. Let's compare bottles right off. I mean, if you can't tell, this is, I mean, they're just, they're not even duping and cloning the scent, but even the bottle is really close. What's the best thing about this? I have to just, we'll call out the price right away. So this is the 100 ml that you get for about $50. 100 ml for $50 and a 50 ml for like $280. And yes, I know you can get this cheaper through trade groups and discounters, but still the cheapest I've seen this isn't even close to $50 for double the amount of juice that you're getting. Let's do a couple sprays of this. I mean, the atomizer is really good for the price, like all the new dupes are, and it just smells so good. Let's just back up a little bit. Let's talk about what Angel Share smells like if you're not familiar with it. The notes are as fa la 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 Cognac, cinnamon, plum, iris, mayo, vanilla, tonka, and sandalwood. Basically, think of a warm, vanillic cinnamon fragrance, heavy on the cinnamon, and boozy with cognac. To me, to sum this up quickly, it smells like if you took a really nice cinnamon roll and kind of dunked it in a glass of cognac. That's the vibe that you're getting with this. I did do a full video review of Angel's Share. If you want to see it, I'll post it up there, brah. Now, enter back in Royal Blend. What do we have here? I got to do another spray. In fact, let's do three on the arm. I just want to see really what we get here. And you know what? I'm going to take Angel Spray. Angel Spray. I'm going to do a spray of Angel Share on the other arm just so I can compare. I've already done this before but I really wanna see how close Royal Blend comes. All right, let's smell. Here's Royal Blend. We're gonna smell that. Very, very similar. Here's Angel Share. Very similar. I almost like Royal Blend better. I'm not gonna lie. Hold, hold on, let, let, let's talk about this. So, the main differences that I smell in the opening is that Royal Blend is a little bit fruitier. There's like a juicy plum note and that plum note is not featured in the original Angel Share. So it makes the opening slightly different, not drastically. I would say about 85% though. It's about 85% similar to Angel Share in the opening. I actually prefer, I really enjoy that plum fruity note. It's just a little bit of a twist. And during that opening, I will say that Angel Share, the original, smells a little bit fuller and a little bit richer, which you'd expect, right? It just feels a little bit like thicker overall, the concentration, a little bit more oil, like oilier. Does that make sense? Just a little bit more potent. J just for the opening though. It just smells a little bit richer. And this one's definitely fresher and a little fruitier. Now, here's where things change drastically in my opinion. The dry down of these fragrances almost get 100%. I'll say 99%. I will say 99% this Royal Blend smells exactly like Angel Share in the dry down. Now, one of the big things with the price difference that I was thinking was the projection and the longevity was gonna be different. But that's the thing, it's not. And usually dupes and clones usually have like weaker projection, weaker longevity as you can expect because you're paying a cheaper price point. This is like the same though. And Angel Share by itself is a beast. We're talking six to eight hours of longevity. This one stacks up. This one projects too. You do more than three sprays, you're gonna be smelled through the whole room. When you pass people, they're gonna smell you. I'm actually quite impressed with Royal Blend. And like I said, I know there's other dupes that are really close, but this one's my favorite. This one's really good. Ghost in the smoke when I slide through the night. Serving through the city, uh. Then I can, uh. The people or a gold friends in my eyes. Got them dripping on the vibe like the drip is too high. And right now, honestly, overall, in the grand scheme of things, I think this one is pretty like slept on or not quite up there yet, right? It's not, nobody's really talking about it too much. It's also hard to find and it's out of stock often, which I understand, but that's sad at the same time. So we got smell, we have about 99% close in the dry down. Like I said, the opening's a little fruitier, about 85. 
Check that though, really good. Price wise, $50 for a 100 ml versus the 280 for the 50. Check that box too, that's really good. Projection, performance, longevity, check it. I would say it's on par. It's literally about the same. And this fragrance is definitely unisex. Some may think that it leans feminine because of the sweetness, because of the cinnamony, almost like cinnamony. I can't say cinnamon, because of the cinnamony, like dessert, gourmand, boozy quality. I could see how it could lean feminine, but I think it's unisex. I think anybody will absolutely smell fantastic on this. This is like, I think one of the best date night fragrances of all time. And yes, it does thrive better in the cooler months, giving the DNA of this, but you could rock this year round. Summer nights would slay with this. I just think it's one of the best fragrances of all time. And I'm sure a lot of people agree with me. Some of you don't, but you know what? Hop off. And that being said, if you don't want to spend the huge amount of money, which I personally don't want to, but this, you know, check this out. And this could be your gateway into the real bottle. I would say this is definitely worth the 50 bucks. And if you love it so much, then if you really want to try the real version, you can do that. There's no rules to this. Sweet and spicy, warm fragrance, cinnamon roll, boozy cognac. Definitely get your nose on this. This is Royal Blend by French Avenue, it comes up. Like I said, that's like a sub-brand of Fragrance World. And honestly, they're just killing the game. They're killing the game. This is so good in my personal opinion. For me personally, like, take out the YouTube, right? Take out all that stuff. I personally would never buy the Real Angel share again if I could get this. Because I think it's that good and it's that close. For me, and for what I do, I'll buy the Real Angel share too. But I'm just saying for most people, I think you can just get away with this one. My name's Ryan and this is the Fragrance Channel. Hit the bell down below, subscribe, brah. I'll have some more videos. I got some bangers coming up in the works. Some straight bangers.